The pressure is on, and opening game nerves can often take hold. Match day one for these two nations here at the 2024 UEFA European Championship. Who will be first to make their mark on the group? Live coverage right here on EA TV. Hello and welcome, and I can tell you it was a dry walk to the gantry today. No rain in sight. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical analysis is Stuart Robson. And excited to be bringing you match day one action at the Euros. It's Slovakia, and they take on Ukraine. Well, these teams know they cannot afford to drop points today. It's so important that they are consistent throughout the group stages if they want to progress further in the tournament. Should be tense, Derek. So we can check on the starting lineup. Well, it'll be interesting to see how the wingers play today. Will they stay high and wide? Will they come in field and support the centre forward? And how deep will they come out of possession? They're going to be key to this formation. Hang on a minute, Stuart. Opportunity unfolding. And a goal! Just what the fans wanted to see. The ideal way to begin. Well, here it is again, and I don't expect keepers to save everything at their near post, but I think he should probably do better. He'll be a little bit disappointed with that. Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Juraj Kutska. Denis Vavro. It's with Milan Skriniar. Stanislav Lobotka. Mack. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Viktor Tsigankov. Artem Dovbik. On the ball, Tara Stepanenko. Zabanyi. And can they make one of these passes count? Like, it's got to be! And a goal to increase their advantage. It's a two-goal lead now. Well, let's see this again. The vision to play this through ball is superb, and the finish is clinical. It just makes it look so easy, doesn't it? So underway again, and a 2-0 advantage here. Skriniar and on to Kutska Kutska on attacking possibilities under real pressure defensively will they pay the price he'll be breathing a sigh of relief ball one could be a chance to break here And a chance to whip it in here. Can he get one back? Oh, my word. There's excellent timing for you. What a challenge. Joachim Konoplia. Viktor Tsigankov. Zinchenko. Magnificent challenge to win it back. And moving the ball forward with genuine purpose here. And to reduce the deficit. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Well, breaking at pace is always a possibility. 
If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. Could cross it in here and angling it back. Tenacious tackling, excellent defending there. And the referee says penalty. So a personnel change then. An opportunity for 3-0. Still a chance. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. Well, an honest assessment, Stuart, would be that he hasn't really been on top of his game and attack. Well, I've been disappointed with his game so far. As those touches show us, he just hasn't been getting into the right sort of areas. That's got to be improved if they're to get back into this one. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Determined defending. Alexander Zinchenko. Mudrik. Promising attack, this. No possibilities in the centre. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Bojanic. Ivan Schrantz. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Duda. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. Here it is now, a substitution. Mudrik on the ball Tara Stepanenko Alexander Zinchenko really getting stuck in plenty of options Duda and the ball is loose well it looks so promising but a goal kick the outcome and time for the change now. Malinowski. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. And teammates around him. Lobotka. Now, what can they do from here? Duda. Well, just the tackle that was needed. Ten minutes to go. Stanislav Lobotka. Timely intervention. Just have to make sure they don't get caught on the counter-attack. Sudakov. And the defenders know they need to get tighter. Fine cross into the middle. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. So one minute of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. 
And with that, the referee blows for full time and Slovakia have lost the game. Stuart, how would you analyse their performance? Well, Derek, I thought it was a subpar performance from them. Just didn't look as sharp as normal. And I don't think they deserved anything from the game. They need to get a better performance in next time out. Well, we're picking him out for a reason. He's had a tremendous game and attack, Stuart. Yeah, he'll be happy coming off the pitch. He worked hard, he was always involved in the game, and he scored a very good goal. That was an impressive performance today.